Hey, it's a beautiful day here across the Ozarks. We have a few clouds, but overall mostly sunny today. We're tracking this system though off to our west. This cold front back in the central plains moves through tomorrow, brings us some storm chances that could be severe. Temperatures tomorrow in the low 80s despite the rain and storm chances and cooler air behind the front on Sunday, quickly rebounding into the start of next week. So the weather set up will have this cold front begin to shift its way on in into Saturday, really arriving though in the late afternoon afternoon hours. So we'll have instability increase throughout the morning and really a lot of instability for storms to work with in the mid afternoon and evening hours set up here across the area. Then that cold front shifts through and we'll look at conditions drying out and instability shifting out of here moving towards Saturday night. But we do have a level two to level three enhanced risk for severe storms across the area. Level one marginal risks in a small portion of the area only back in our westernmost counties but I do think all of us have the potential for severe storms and potentially very large hail. So heading into Saturday morning, some isolated showers back here across southern Missouri, northern Arkansas. Thunderstorm chances though north of I-44. We could see a few stronger ones here and there, uh, but I think that greatest severe risk picks up in the late afternoon and evening hours. We're dry by around 1 p.m. We could even see some sunshine. Here's storm chances firing off ahead of the cold front by around 3, 4 p.m. These very likely to become supercells producing large hail and heavy rain. This is a look at 5 p.m. They organize a bit better in that linear fashion and then shift their way off in our easternmost counties around 7 p.m. And we could see maybe a few isolated showers Saturday night, but these wouldn't be severe. I'd say that severe threat wraps up around 8, 9 p.m. So you can go to bed Saturday night resting easy. Now that tornado threat is low, it's not zero, but I do think our biggest concern within these storms will actually be some very, very large hail. And we could also see some strong gusty winds upwards of 70 miles an hour. So that hail threat on Saturday, I think it's going to be highlighted in this area in yellow where we have the threat for larger hail that could be greater than tennis ball size. And if you're not in this highlighted area, anywhere here across the Ozarks could see some large at least quarter to golf ball size hail the largest hail likely in this area and specifically pinpointing this a little further in this highlighted area in south central Missouri and northern Arkansas. I think that could be the greatest threat for hail around tennis ball to baseball size. Winds will also begin to pick up in the afternoon gusting around 30 to 35 miles an hour and then by Sunday we'll see gusts around 30 to 40 miles an hour with increased fire danger for your Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. Today, temperatures upper 70s to low 80s. By around 9 p.m., we're still really warm, upper 60s to low 70s, with overnight lows tonight in the low 60s. So a very warm start to the weekend. Once again, we'll be touching near 80 Saturday with the storms rolling through. And then by Monday, we'll be more, we'll see more sunshine, I should say, and temperatures back in the 70s and 80s through the middle of next week with more rain chances Wednesday and Thursday.